and welcome to episode 64 of Art Book Reviews. Today, I have uh, one that I've picked up recently. I was looking for art books and I found this sealed, and I saw the size of it, looks all right size, for five quid. I mean, for that price, I thought, why not? I have zero knowledge of this game. I have no idea. I'm assuming it's a, uh, what do you call it? A visual novel. It took me far too long to remember <laughs> what that genre is. Um, yeah, uh, it's Tom Twenty Twenty. I mean, I, I saw more sealed for five quid. So I guess it looks like it came up again. So I thought I might as well check it out. Let's have a quick nook. So I don't know what what this one would fall into really. Whether this is tier one, tier two. If it's a visual novel. It'll probably be tier one. Yeah, just team and stuff. Oh, blooming neck. No. No, no, no. That's this is a bad sign. Have I have I picked up a uh, eighteen rated art book? I hope not. Um also swim girls and swimsuits with an AK and some machine pistols. Interesting. I have no idea what's going on. This, they're not too, far too happy to be for that. Well, that's interesting. We're doing rain. Now that sounds on a bit daft. What's so special about that? But how often in a game, especially like an anime game, do you see a wedding ring? It, it's, I don't know, for me, I'm, I can't recall many times. It's just a nice little wholesome thing. Just something you don't really see. Okay, Tom. Awesome. <laughs> Thanks for that. Skip ahead a little bit. See what else we've got in here. Is anything worth... Just bits of artwork. The characters. A breakdown, I guess, of their storyline. Also, I never understood this. The Dama Is it Damaches? Dama Dama yeah. The big giant pillows that you hug on a night, I never understood that. Um, always seemed weird to me, but maybe that's just me. Ah. Nope, protection modesty, why not? I shouldn't like that, that's not something I like, but that is adorable. That is quite adorable, actually. Um, I don't know. Skimming through here, the romance scenes. It seems like a bit more mature visual novel, but at the same time, nothing too bad. I guess not actually showing you to again close. Um, yeah. Some risque stuff. Um. I don't know, it's a tier one, it's clearly a tier one, it's just art from the game itself, no no concept, no sketching, no descriptors of any sort, which is quite disappointing, it's a good size and it's five quid, so if you want a small, if you've got like a little small art book selection, like a little mini shelf to put these, you can fit quite a lot on the shelf and you just need one for that cheap price, maybe, but... I'm actually quite sad to this. All visual novel game art books are crap. I can't think of any visual art book, visual novel art books that I've reviewed that's been any good. The only inclusion you could probably put on that is maybe. Ah, you can't even put that on there. I was going to say. Um, Life is Strange. But even Life is Strange has puzzles that, uh, but yeah, it has proper gameplay to it. It's, yeah, it's an action novel. So I couldn't even include that. If any just basic visual novels, they're all being crap. Unless you're really into that kind of thing where you just got screenshots from the game just on, on book format. Which just means there's no point playing the game. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It's difficult. It's so cheap, so I find it very hard to give it 
too much of a negative review for it. Um, but at the same time, it's just basic. You got a little bit of pointless risque in there. I don't know what to make of it. It's probably not one I'm going to keep for my collection. I bought it. I bought it more for the idea of seeing what was in it for review for that bargain price. I keep picking up art books. But yeah. I think this is going to be one for the uh, nope pile. But anyway, I'll stop waffling and I'll let you guys get on with your life. So, until next time, goodbye.